Be tuned into what they're doing on the court. You're right, Jenny. Concentration is going to be key for sure, but uh, I think everybody's surprised because, you know, when, when I started UTS, everybody said, oh, to have a crowd loud during the points and uh, people move using angles. He, get, he, he plays very central, he plays slower, and then he accelerates when he has the right one. That's exactly what Hugo will have to do, too. Oh. Oh. Prime example there of Massessi's magic. Playing a lot. And his work ethics lately has become something. So for sure. Sure, Hugo has seen so many guys trying to go for winner one after the other. Oh, big forehand from the Italian. That's three points, and that's how you earned them. Perfect angle. See how Musetti plays central, that gives no angle to go. Go Even Musetti this. Hi Lorenzo, it's Patrick again, you're not tired of seeing me? Not yet? <laughs> Not yet, not yet. <laughs> you tell me huh, when, you, when you, you don't want to see me anymore. <laughs> no, um, no, no. I, I just want to tell you that I'm very impressed because I, I know you for a long time and uh, I have never seen you, not only this week, but those past weeks and months, so focused, uh, able to really uh, stay calm on the court and uh, not lose your mind at any point. What did change you so much? <laughs> Probably becoming a father, it helped me a lot, honestly, on the, on the patient side. But uh, yeah, we know each other since a long time. I remember when I used to, used to come to, the, to your academy, I was really a, a kid with a lot of dreams. Uh, of course, uh, a lot changed. A lot of things changed from, from there, since there. But uh, yeah, especially this year has been uh, incredibly... Uh, I think I, I made uh, some step forwards on, uh, on that. I um, totally agree with you, but I think to, uh, you know, uh, to go even farther, uh, I will have even to do more on that and to work more on that. But this quarter was uh, pretty difficult, I have to say. But, uh, you know, I, I really focused well on the bonus car, on my bonus car, and, uh, you know, that probably was the key of the quarter. Your first question, Patrick, Bravo. Bravo. for Lorenzo, and he, the answer was... I mean, his ranking now is definitely uh, because not only that, but also that. And the second thing is working like crazy. Went, they came all the way from France to support the French uh, players. Hugo and Gael. Uber trying to get a bit of momentum. Beginning of this. Wow. Yeah. That's 
It's amazing. And you see when uh, Lorenzo gives uh, some angle. Have you got another Zenith water 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 water. <laughs> He definitely deserves it. My he goodness. can have a second one. <laughs> wow. Hey, look at that. Oh my god, this change of rhythm again. That's really, really nice to see. Lucetti plays a little bit shorter and then one millisecond after you see Hugo Ambert stepping in, taking the ball early and taking advantage of it. Same here, exactly the same with the back. Oh, he's going back. He's locked in. And he's drawing on his French fans big time. Why not when you're performing? I haven't seen that at all. So simple, so clean. Sort of point you want after a little bit of bear there. Three plus one. So beautiful. Oh, what the hell? There you go. Such a great pick up from him there. He's going to come back. On this one. Yeah. Can you also translate the Italian that slid the undertone during the pop? Strange shot. I don't know why he tried to do it. Hey, Mick. Who's that? Hey, please tell me. Hey. It's like a Kylie Minogue song. <laughs> <laughs> So sneaked in after this very good attack. From the Italian, something we haven't had. Yeah, but the more physically and mentally tired you get throughout the tournament. The French fans are very, very loud today. Does so it help good. you? <laughs> yeah, a lot. They're completely crazy, like me, so <laughs> I really <laughs> like it. <laughs> what is your favorite thing when they're singing or when they're moving Both. around the court or? Both. They're just fabulous. I love when they sing my name and uh, my nickname, so it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people told me that uh, players would hate to have noise during the points. What do you think about that? No, I think. Uh, it's okay when uh, you know it's like this uh, with the music and everything. Uh, no, I feel really comfortable. I really like to, to play uh, with uh, this atmosphere, atmosphere. Sorry. As a statement. <laughs> Are we going to get a second sudden death semi final? I think so because I think that uh, One, now that he has no more option. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my God. Who won? And the second gave him a bit of a lifelike, but what a shot. Yeah, it was tactically not the right choice. I mean, it's easy to say afterwards, but he's inside the court. He plays. Bags in the building, so. Oh, yeah, that's true. He's taken that on. Uh, just perfect. So smart. He saw that Lorenzo was about to hit a slide. You hear the coach? Not happy. My God. What a defense. Oh, my God. That's a joke. Oh, my God. Oh, he would have got that over. And Massetti, oh. as it were, we're 11 apiece. Still the defensive skills of the Italian. Dennis, my God. Full stretch. Wasn't far away either. And the second most important. One more point for Musetti, and then he's, he will have a point to come back two quarters at all. No! It's long, and Hugo Humbert is into his first UTS final. Tribune blur. Well, they've been loud today. They got behind their man. The Frenchman will take on Ben Shelton in the UTS Frankfurt final. Commiserations to Lorenzo Massetti. He was undefeated until this match. He's been superb, but Patrick Umbert, after going a quarter down at the start as well, what a performance. Yeah, the performance was amazing. He really played Massetti the right way, changing rhythm.